you're standing in a 10,000 square foot training facility for the seeing eye. Uh, they have parking spaces in here for 18 of their vans, doggy fountains, um, pitched concrete for easy cleaning, drainage, and it's conditioned, uh, insulated space. They, uh, they have easy access to the city above and they train dogs for blind people. Um, underneath us here is actually a more complex system of 22 geothermal wells dug to a depth of 500 feet deep. The original project had 400 foot dug wells at 26 total wells and we decided to eliminate four of them and bring it, bringing it a little deeper which actually helped save the owner some money. Uh, the turnkey costs for geothermal about $18,000 a well and the trick to a successful geothermal system are being able to space them apart and where you hit rock. So let's talk about spacing first. You need 30 feet of space between each well because over the course of say 20 to 50 years the ground temperature will actually heat up which will throw off your HVAC system in the building. Um, the rock aspect, uh, it's very expensive to drill a hole where there's no rock because as you're drilling the hole, the hole collapses. So you need to install six inch steel casing as you're drilling. So you bring in a, a big drill bit and it drills down through the earth and as you're drilling, you're installing casing. In our case, we have rock at 150 foot down. So in each well, we installed 150 foot of casing. As soon as you hit rock, you bring in a second type of rig, which is an, an air compressor, which pulverizes the rock and blows the rock out of the hole. You continue to your depth of 500 feet. You install two two-inch PVC hoses, which are wrapped at the bottom, coming on a big spool. You unload that spool, push the hose to the bottom of the well, and you fill the well with cementitious grout, which is a liquid form of cement. You cap it off, you run it horizontally into the office building, and they're all tied in at the manifolds. 